Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of All About AI Tech. Today, we are diving into one of the most groundbreaking and controversial moves in the tech industry, Meta's audacious strategy to give away its cutting-edge AI technology for free. Yes, you heard that right. In a move that has shocked Silicon Valley and beyond, Mark Zuckerberg's Meta Platforms is investing tens of billions of dollars in high-end computer chips, top-flight scientists, and massive amounts of electricity to develop the most powerful AI tools, only to give them away for free. But why would anyone do that? Think about Facebook, Instagram, and WhatsApp, all free services that have become an integral part of our daily lives. Meta is betting that by making its most advanced AI tools free, it can replicate that success in the AI space. Imagine using free AI models for everything from writing code to answering complex queries in human-like ways. But it's not just about providing users with free AI tools. It's also about undercutting the competition. By making high-quality AI accessible to everyone, Meta aims to drive down competitors' prices. Companies that charge for their AI tech will find it hard to compete with free. Just last week, we saw OpenAI releasing GPT-40, Google launching new versions of its Gemma AI models. But here's the catch, they are not giving away the underlying code. They sell access to their AI models to make money. The stakes are high, with OpenAI raising $13 billion and Google boosting its capital expenditures by 50%. Meta expects to spend an additional $10 billion in 2024 on AI development. Despite this enormous investment, there's no clear immediate revenue stream. Investors were initially skeptical, with Meta's shares plunging 10% after it announced its AI spend. So, what's the endgame here? Despite the initial shock, there's growing support for Meta's bold move. Analysts and some investors are starting to see the long-term benefits. Open-source AI might just be the key to Meta dominating the AI landscape, much like Android did with mobile operating systems. Last month, Meta released Llama 3, its latest generative AI tool, for free to companies with fewer than 700 million users. You can now find Llama 3 integrated into Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp, Messenger, and even on the web, bringing advanced AI capabilities directly to your fingertips. Interestingly, Mark Zuckerberg himself has been hands-on with this initiative. In March, he accelerated the project, giving teams just one month to fully integrate Meta AI into key platforms. This kind of hands-on leadership, affectionately termed the Eye of Sauron by employees, is a hallmark of Zuckerberg's approach to critical projects. Now, you might wonder, why would users care? Well, if you're using Meta's apps, you'll notice that search functions have gotten a lot smarter. Instead of just finding posts or pictures, Meta AI can help answer your questions more accurately and efficiently. And sure, there's been some pushback. Some users initially hated the AI feature in searches. But remember when Facebook first rolled out its newsfeed? The initial reception was rocky, but today it's essential. Meta bets that users will come around as Meta AI improves. Imagine searching for a specific recipe on Facebook and Meta AI not just finding it but offering you a step-by-step -step guide. Or asking Instagram for holiday gift ideas and getting personalized recommendations. The possibilities are immense. One of the biggest advantages of releasing the Llama models as open source is the community that comes with it. Within days of its release, developers made enhancements allowing the model to handle 20 times as many tokens as before. This rapid improvement is only possible because thousands of bright minds are working on it collectively. It's also a major draw for top AI researchers who value the freedom to publish their work. By choosing open source, Meta taps into a vast pool of talent eager to push the boundaries of what AI can do. This strategy allows Meta to control its destiny in a way it couldn't during the mobile phone revolution. Back then, Meta was at the mercy of Apple and Google, the gatekeepers of mobile operating systems. This time, Meta is laying its own groundwork. Imagine a future where Meta's AI tools are the standard. By making high-quality AI free and open source, Meta ensures its technology becomes the foundation for the next wave of internet applications. This is the long game, where Meta potentially owns the interface between humans and AI. But what about security concerns? There's a valid fear that open source AI models could fall into the wrong hands. Meta has engaged with officials in the US and internationally to address these concerns. There are also technical guardrails in place to limit misuse. Meta's open source license for Llama models includes restrictions on their use. 
These measures are designed to prevent adversaries from repurposing the AI for harmful activities, ensuring the technology benefits everyone. Ultimately, Meta's ethos remains consistent, connecting people. With Meta AI, it intends to connect users with AI that helps them in their daily lives, whether it's answering questions, assisting with tasks, or sparking creativity. This is Meta striving to lay the foundation for a more interconnected, AI-empowered world. Let's not forget, the open source community is incredibly powerful. Just like open source software revolutionized the tech industry, open source AI can democratize access to advanced technology, fostering innovation from unexpected places. Imagine the educational possibilities. Students could use Meta AI for personalized tutoring, tackling subjects they find difficult with the help of an ever-improving AI model. Think of the impact on healthcare, where AI can assist doctors in diagnosing and treating patients more efficiently. For startups and smaller businesses, Meta's free AI tools could be game changers. They can harness top-tier AI without the prohibitive costs, allowing more room for creativity and innovation. This levels the playing field and accelerates the pace of technological advancement. Meta's vision extends far beyond just gaining a competitive edge. It's about reshaping the very landscape of AI development. By making advanced AI tools free and open source, Meta is encouraging a collaborative, rather than monopolistic, approach to AI. Compare this with competitors who keep their AI advancements under lock and key. Meta's approach could set a benchmark, fostering a more open and inclusive AI ecosystem. This strategic move has the potential to democratize AI technology, making it accessible to anyone with a good idea and a will to learn. So, what does this mean for you? It means the AI-driven future isn't just reserved for tech giants or those with deep pockets. It's for everyone. Whether you're an entrepreneur, a student, or just someone curious about what AI can do, Meta's strategy is designed to bring powerful, cutting-edge technology to your fingertips without the hefty price tag. Stay tuned as we keep you updated on this evolving story. The AI landscape is changing rapidly, and Meta's audacious strategy is sure to spark a lot of conversations and innovations around the globe. If you found this information valuable, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and click the bell icon so you don't miss any future updates. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. How do you feel about Meta's open source approach to AI? We'd love to hear from you. That's all for today's episode. Remember, in the ever-changing world of AI, staying informed is key. Thanks for watching all about AI tech. Take care and see you next time.